The purpose of our visit here in Washington, D.C., is to um, launch an appeal, a heartfelt appeal, on behalf of the people of the Central African Republic. For the past year, our people have um, been undergoing very dark hours, and we cannot simply stand by with indifference when we look at our people plunge into the greatest depths of despair. And that is why, as religious leaders, we have risen and we have joined forces we are forming a united front in order to denounce uh, and to condemn the exactions committed against civilians in the CR. The reason we are here in the United States today is because um, the solution provided by the Sangaris, the French uh, mission, and the MISCA, the solutions that they are offering are unsatisfactory. We believe that it is time for us, we believe it is time for the entire human nation, for the United Nations to organize an operation whereby all people can uh, be present in order to defend this humanitarian cause. Indeed, um, this crisis which is afflicting our country is impacting civilians, civilians who are dying. These are people who are innocent. They're dying gratuitously. These are farmers. These are people who simply want to labor their fields. They are being felled. They need, they're leaving their homes and they are killed. And it would seem that a, a few bandits have taken hostage the entire African people. And that is why we are launching this appeal so that the men and the women of the world can also say no, no to the situation.